Museveni, who President Clinton in some yester years called a new breed of leaders in Africa, is now many times worse than Idi Amin. He kills people for disagreeing with him. He kills people for using their brains. He kills people, abducts them, and forces them to disappear forever for exercising their constitutional right. And that is why we are not fear, fear uh, we are not fearing anymore to demand for our people. Many of them are missing because they put on this burden. And I repeat the challenge, I challenge you seven to arrest me and charge me in any court of law for wearing this beret, you old coward. Old coward! You have disrespected your age. Mutu mazemo akobuntu, mutu mazemo obuntu bulamu. Plochi mutu wabantu bakti. Recently, the European Union Parliament passed a resolution stopping the construction of the eco pipeline and among the, 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 the reasons raised was abuse of human rights gross abuse of human rights it's interesting that Museveni for the first time said he's going to court since when did Museveni start respecting the law and yes Museveni using our children he lied to them that they are meeting student leaders only to woodwink them to go and protest for his interest. This is the same person that killed hundreds of unarmed civilians, including women and children, on the 18th and 19th of November 2020 for protesting. And now he believes in protest. It's at this exact time that I want to encourage all of you to know that protesting and demonstrating works. So please, whoever can, please demonstrate and protest demanding for your people.